What's up guys, it's Cole from Virtual Gaming and today I'm going to be doing my review of Titanfall. Now this is a long anticipated game coming out for the Xbox One and the Xbox 360 and the, P and the PC. Fortunately this is not a uh, PlayStation game uh, because Microsoft did have a part in the creation of this game so they decided not to release it for the uh, PlayStation. Now I'm playing this game on the Xbox One. This is being recorded with the Xbox Game DVR. So the current uh, video settings are 720p 30. Um, now the game in terms of graphics is absolutely gorgeous, um, especially for the next gen consoles. I really do feel like I am playing uh, one of my PC games, uh, you know, maxed out. It, it does look very good. I mean, obviously there is aliasing things, but it still does look very, very good. It is a fun game. I love it. It is amazing. Um, this is definitely a big refresh for me in terms of first-person shooters. You know, it's it's a lot better than, you know, the standard just running around shooting guys uh, Battlefield game. I mean, it just works so well. I mean, it... The, it's I love the new concept where you're able to, you know, use the map to your advantage and use kind of the parkour skills almost that you're allowed to, uh, you know, use in this game to your advantage and be able to run around wherever you want and, you know, discover new positions. And it, that's also something that you have to get used to. You have to, you know, kind of get used to the fact that you can do those types of things. You, you know, a lot of times you don't really remember that uh and you just are sticking to the map and like obvious sniper positions that you can really kind of get to um and you need to think about the fact that you can really get wherever you want in this game uh that also comes from the other end where you have to remember if you're looking around for guys they can be in totally different areas now i mean now roof rooftops have become way more active because you can climb up onto like these little tiny things and kind of balance up there um, almost like you're in Assassin's Creed and just take guys out. I mean, it's, it's, it's a really just this amazing new way of playing. And also, you know what, you know, with, I mean, it's an, it's a, it's just such a great new way of playing. I mean, in this clip that's coming up right now, I mean, you, you just see the uh, kind of the movement and I call it Titan and then just decide to run around. Um, just how you can just get all these places so it's like I started falling there but I can just kind of pick myself back up and you know I can I can go over on my map I'm gonna make this jump all the way to the other side of the map you know in Battlefield you'd never be able to get there unless there was a ladder it just really adds these totally new ways and you can wall run I mess this up but you can wall run wherever you want I mean it's truly just a great way of playing this game now with the Titans, I think there's a clip earlier with me and the Titans. I might have missed it. Um, you know, the Titans, just, you know, I was going into this game, I was thinking, okay, that's a little weird. Because it's like you get the Titan automatically, basically. It's not like a kill streak or anything. And then I would think you'd be completely, like, there would, basically you would, I guess what I'm trying to say is kind of at that point you'd be like invincible but really they did a really great job in designing the titans where when you have a titan you're you know you're really big and you're cumbersome you can't you know you obviously you can't jump anywhere and you just you your weapons are usually are either one shot one very powerful shot that takes a little while to hit or a multiple shots in succession but then a long reload time um, so that you really have to learn how to use your Titan wisely. There's a lot of different things you can do, but you need to learn how to use them wisely. And also, you know, the good thing is that f for uh, for kind of, I guess, the humans on the ground, um, they're, they can do a lot of damage to a Titan. You have, uh, like, rockets, and you also have, uh, you can climb up onto the Titan, which might be a clip right now. You can climb up onto the Titan, and uh, shoot, and basically shoot, bypass any armor. You just shoot the like the electronics inside, and from that point you can, you know that at that from that point the Titan is destroyed. Now you can't eject from the Titan. Then there's a thing called nuclear ejection, which basically 
you know throws you out and then your titan goes nuclear and can kill people that are within the blast area it's not like a huge nuclear explosion or anything like that but really this game i have to give it top marks i love this game it's an excellent refresh of the first person shooter definitely a lot better than halo i mean it is a game that i truly love and definitely will be playing for a long time uh in the future so as i said 10 out of 10 on this game definitely guys go out and buy it it's totally worth it worth it no matter what platform you're on unless it's playstation um you know and just just play this game it's a lot of fun i really really enjoy it it's a definitely a great refresh and a great new playing style so anyway guys that's it for this video this has been another video from brochilla gaming thanks for watching spam that like button and i'll see you guys next time